Good morning, Atlantic Coast High School. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and remain standing for a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Thank you. Please be seated. It's Monday, October 23rd, and welcome to the Morning Rays. Students who made straight A's and AB honor roll during the first nine weeks will be celebrated this Thursday during all lunches. Tough Guy Cookies will be here on campus baking fresh chocolate chip and confetti cookies. Tickets for students who have earned them will be distributed during sixth period this Wednesday. Make sure you keep your ticket to get your treat the next day. If you have any questions or concerns, please see Ms. Thomas, our assistant principal. Congratulations to senior Ben Brown, who placed fifth in the Gateway Conference Cross Country Championships. For the third time during his four-year career, Ben has earned all conference honors. Tryouts for our girls' basketball team are next week beginning on Monday and concluding on Wednesday. The tryouts will be from 2.20 to 4.45 each day starting on October 30th and ending on November 1st. Bring some basketball shoes and water and make sure you've completed your athletic clearance paperwork before tryouts begin. Our varsity football team gave Reigns a run for their money this past Friday night. We lost 29-22, to but we had the Vikings on the ropes, and we let them off the hook. This Thursday is our final home game of the season. That's right, it's Thursday. We will be hosting Creekside, and kickoff is scheduled for 6.30, but you'll want to arrive by 6 because it's senior night. We'll be having a ceremony to honor the senior members of our football team, cheerleaders, dance team, and band. In the days leading up to this senior night and in the days following, we will be highlighting certain members of these groups, starting with our cheerleading captain, Shania Dunn. To be the cheer captain of my team means to leave, lead all my teammates and just encourage everybody, keep everybody going when things get rough. What are the most important responsibilities of being a cheer captain? Um, making sure everybody's on time, making sure everybody got the same hairstyle, uniform, practice, all that. I have a whole bunch of little sisters and siblings and I've just always grown up to lead them, do their hair, help them out. And I'm also the captain, or not the captain, but the coach of a Tiny Might Cheer team. So just coaching the littles and then coming up to the bigger girls really helped me. When I came here my sophomore year from Mandarin, um, I met a lot of my friends that I have now still, and it just helped me grow new friendships and keep them throughout high school. Well, the people who say cheerleading is not a sport, I want you to come out to practice and let us, let us see you do some flips, let us see you lift some people up, same weight. In four years, I hope to be cheering. Um, I want to go to college to major in public health, and I want to be a dentist, so yeah. You won't want to miss out if you haven't had the chance to register for the informational meeting for the summer 2025 trip to Japan. Be sure to respond today with the link that can be found in the bio of the Morning Rays Instagram and in the QR code on your screen. At tomorrow's meeting, we will talk about the itinerary, the dates, cost, and attendees of the meeting will have the chance to be among the first to enroll. Spots are limited. Thank you to everyone who came to the last MindWell meeting on self-esteem. We will be holding our next meeting today after school in room 627 from 2 to 3 p.m. All are welcome and we look forward to seeing you. A reminder that the Ping Pong Club will meet after school today in the downstairs 500 building. Anyone can come by and join in on the fun. Those are all the announcements for today. Have a great day and go Stingrays.